Hey guys, it's Alessia Carr. I'm here at Amoeba Music, and here is what's in my bag. There's a hope that's waiting for you in the dark. You should know you're beautiful just the way you are. And you don't have to change a thing. The world could change its heart. No scars, so you're beautiful. We stars, and we're beautiful. So the first thing I got is a Amy Winehouse vinyl of her first album called Frank. Um, I have this on digital and physical, but I don't have the vinyl. This is one of my favorite albums ever, I think. It's just like a really interesting mixture of like jazz and hip hop and just a bunch of cool stuff. And I remember I found a song called Stronger Than Me, which is the first song. You should be stronger than me. But instead, you're longer. And it just became like my favorite song ever, like of all time. It's so good. This entire album is beautiful. I love it. Um, the next thing I got is another vinyl um, by a newer artist called Anderson Pack. He produces and like writes everything that he does, and I think it's just so amazing. It's like a mixture again of just like hip hop and jazz and soul, and he's just really, really talented. My faith is buried somewhere underneath the town. I discovered him uh, earlier this year and I just like fell in love with everything he does. I'm curious to see him live. Apparently he's amazing. The new Rihanna album, Anti. I really, really love this album. I'm a huge fan of Rihanna's um, and I think this album is just, it was really eccentric and different um, and every song was different from each other but it still kind of fit. Consideration is probably my favorite. When I look outside It's just a very strange song, but I, I really, really love it. Um, and I love Love on the Brain as well, which she does amazing live. I actually saw Rihanna for the anti-tour recently, a couple of months ago, um, and it was like, my mind was blown. She's just such a good performer and all the songs are, like came to life so beautifully. It was such a great show. I was really um, impressed by her. Her presence in general is just so impactful. She could just be like standing at the mic, but just her movements, her cadence is just so on point and it really, really, um, I don't know, it just kind of struck a really interesting chord with me and I, I was really intrigued and impressed by what she, what she did, it was awesome. Another new album called Conscious by one of my favorite bands, I don't know if they're even a band or like a duo called Broods. They're from New Zealand um, and I discovered them, I believe it was last year, maybe two years ago. And they're just really, really interesting. They have like this really cool electronic pop kind of vibe. Um, I love their writing style, and I, I think this is just a great album. The last thing I got is not music. It is of a music artist, but it is a poster the classic mugshot <laughs> of Frank Sinatra. This is one of my favorite pictures ever. It was actually like the profile picture of various social media accounts of mine for a very long time. It's just, I don't know, something about this picture is just really, really cool and I think he's just so badass and I love it. I discovered Frank Sinatra kind of on my own. I mean, my family listened to a lot of oldies stuff, but jazz music in general I kind of found on my own. And um, when I discovered him, I don't know, something about his music was just so like mellow and it kind of took me to a nice place. And I remember hearing his song called I've Got a Crush on You. It was one of my favorites. The world will pardon my mush Cause I have got a crush My baby on you Thank you very much. Appreciate it guys, thank you so much. So tell my friends that I'll be over here